boxing is not a blood sport. It's not for cavemen. Boxing is relatable to the common man. Always has been, always will be. There's nothing like the story. Boxing is a poor man's sport. Back in the day, it was the working man putting himself on the line to make a quick buck and put some extra bread on the table to feed his family. Boxing is life. Boxing has existed for two millennia, but March 30th, 2024, will mark a monumental leap forward as the first ever championship boxing card premieres on Prime Video in America. It's a historic evolution, an opportunity to scale skyward, potentially higher than ever before. Four fighters have been chosen to lead the charge into this new era. They will climb into the ring and demonstrate to a new audience the depths of resilience and human spirit necessary to endure the rigors of combat as they fight for themselves, their families, their countries, and for the sport they were born for. Okay, good afternoon, everybody. We're about to get started, so any interviews that you're doing, media, please finish them up and take your seats. And fighters, please make your way to the sides of the stage to get ready to come up on stage. Thank you. Welcome to the kickoff press conference for the inaugural PBC pay-per-view boxing event on Prime Video. On a night of new beginnings, why one fights matters more than ever. It's Saturday night, and I'm itching for a fight. For Keith One Time Thurman, the main event is about reminding the world that his experience, power, and ring savvy continue to stand the test of time, even against a hard-charging, fast-rising star. I don't even know what you do. I just know they say you come from down under, and I am trying to put you under, mate. For super welterweight champion Tim Zhu, he of the boxing bloodline, souls taken, fear instilled. It's charting the path toward becoming a remember him forever type by dispatching a luminary of the sport. I'm planning not to just beat Keith Thurman, but I'm planning to make a spectacle that he's never seen before. The co-main event features Isak Cruz, a ferocious brawler who's earned his pit bull nickname, all blood, guts, and will. A él le gusta hablar, a mí también me gusta hablar, pero arriba del ring con los puños. Estoy en el mejor momento de mi carrera. Mi sentimiento es poder arrebatarle el campeonato del mundo. His fight is for family, country, and his opponent's super lightweight belt. I'm kicking off Amazon Prime. People don't understand how big this actually is. It's going to be fireworks. It's going to be pop, 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 pop. For Roly Romero, the flamboyant phenom, clad in mink coats and cloaked, and absurdity. It's proving he deserves the respect owed a champion by not just taunting a pit bull, but biting back. Uh, Chihuahua, Poodle, uh, he kind of looks like a pug right now, so a little fat right now. Thus the stakes for March 30th. New era, new network, new crowns to be claimed. For four boxers, what better way to deliver on a night that guarantees new beginnings? than to seize a new day. The time has come for him. Welcome to the Team Zoom era. This is what boxing is about. Action, action, action. Let's start the year off right, homie. Let's do it, bro. Tim Zhu, he's the undefeated champion of the world. He wants to remain undefeated. Keith Thurman has to be a stepping stone for him. It's a rite of passage to take out a two-time champion. Yeah, I'm a welterweight champion. That should give him a little bit more confidence. He's the, he's the bigger man. Tim Zhu is not slick. 
He ain't no slick Rick in there. He thinks he's just gonna throw the old clubber at me. You know? The moment that I can't wait for with Tim Zhu, make him miss, make him pay. If I was Tim Zhu, I would think I'm the younger man. I've been active. What's Keith done? One time's fought one time since the Pacquiao fight. You think I'm, I'm washed up? I'm just here for the check because I got two kids. Bring it, baby. Get off, boys. Get off. Keith, one time Thurman is back. I'm going to reestablish myself at the highest level of boxing in a new division on a new network, reaching out to a global new fan base. Someone's going to be in pain. Someone's going to be disappointed. And it's not going to be me. Keith. Keith Thurman's illustrious 17-year professional career is a testament to heart, confidence, and formidable pugilistic skill. Luckily, hints of these traits glimmered in childhood and were identified by the man who would ultimately set Thurman on his boxing journey, the indelible trainer, Ben Getty. When Junior was started out, he was found this young, talented young kid, about seven years old, and he was rocking. I mean, he was rocking Junior like a Pez dispenser. Head popped back. And I, his father, was about to throw the towel in because I didn't want to see that happen to my son. And Ben Getty said, he said, no. He said, look, look. I said, what are you talking about? He's getting killed. <laughs> and what I saw when I looked was that every time he got popped, he took a step forward. He got rocks. He took a step forward. That's not something you can teach a person to have heart. He had heart from the beginning. That's why I know he's meant for this sport. So that's my take on that. <laughs> ben Getty made Keith Thurman. He told everybody at any gym that we ever went to, this kid right here has what it takes to be champion of the world. Me and Ben worked together ever since I was seven years old. And I remember being at his funeral on that day where I'm just looking at his body in the casket. A lot of emotions were coming up, but no words. And in the moment too, there weren't even really tears. It was, what, what, what do I do now? And uh, I remember coming back to this gym on the first day without coach. And I stood right here for like 20 seconds. I couldn't even get myself to do one pull up. I just didn't want to do the pull up. I didn't even want to be in the gym without coach. He used to say, you want to go home, boy? You don't want to work today? You want to go home? Is that what you want to do? I'll drive you home. I'll take you home right now. Like, nah, coach, we're in the gym. I mean, I'm going to train. And it wasn't, it wasn't until I heard his voice asking me if I wanted to go home that I finally reached up. When I didn't speak at his funeral, in my heart of hearts, I said one thing and one thing only. There's nothing to say. There's just a lot of work to do. And my whole life mission from that day forward was making sure Ben Getty never told a lie and that Keith One Time Thurman would become champion of the world one day. You excited? Yeah, man. I'm excited for you. This car is an absolute blast. We are in the beautiful Ferrari 48 GTB. Let's go out there and have some fun, okay? Line drop, shift up, merge the left, shift up. Nice job. Beautiful, yeah, man. Oh, that's crazy. Open up that wheel and accelerate. Look easy, look easy. Got it. Remember, in the church, we want to be a little bit patient, okay? Tim Zhu, his moniker is Soul Taker. I think he needs to change it to Risk Taker. from Zhu. Major moments for the Australian world champion. I like challenges. I like things that get your heart beating, you know? Don't forget to breathe, all right? 
<laughs> How cool is that, brother? That's sick. I'm not satisfied. I'm still looking for that next thrill, that next big fight, the next adrenaline rush. It's, it's a crazy addictive feeling. The undefeated super welterweight champion of the world, Tim Zoom! I feel like I'm a lion chasing a gazelle in a boxing fight. Um, it's a different type of competitiveness. Where you see you see the pain in their eyes or you see a little a noise, their little squeak that they make. That's 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 the stuff that that drives me. As a boxer, how important is activity? Because nowadays people you know, fight once a year maybe. So yeah man, that's that's the thing. Everyone these days they they're just a bunch of pussies. Especially in this sport now they're just like they're going downhill there's more Twitter battles rather than boxing fights, and it's like, I'm the other way around. I'm a fighter, an old school throwback type thing, and, and I feel like, you know, the, the real boxing uh, lovers uh, will embrace that. This, this. That's it, play with your speed, that's it. Bam, 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 Tim Zhu's ferocity is well known down under. An undefeated world champion, the Soul Taker has already headlined 12 Australian pay-per-view events. But Thurman represents the next level, a wider market to conquer, teeming with marquee souls to take. Australia was great, but it felt like I was a big fish in a small pond. It's time to step it up a notch, put the gear up and catch a gazelle. Simple. <laughs> Shocker. <laughs> I'm not usually calling her, that's why. What's wrong? Yeah, what's wrong with it? Hello? Hi. Yeah. Are you okay? <laughs> <laughs> what's going on? Are you okay? Yeah, I'm alright. What's up? You look um, red. You look like you're blushing. No, I'm not blushing. Are you nervous to see me? <laughs> <laughs> Fucking hell. <laughs> what's, what's, what's up? I'm just giving you a buzz. You, you called, called me, me before. You called me? You called me before. You me alone. <laughs> you just miss me so much. Of course. Of course I miss you. Dude, I drove a Ferrari. The 488. Which one? 488. Oh, how much is it? <laughs> Half a million. Would you buy it? <laughs> <laughs> I don't know, Did we'll you see. Buy it? Yes or no? Yeah, I would actually. We'll see. I don't know, we'll see. I don't like to, to talk too much about it, but when I disappear from home, it's difficult. Get away from just my partner and my family. Say hi to everyone. My fiance, <laughs> Alexandra. How long have you guys been together? Seven years. Of course, I love home. There's nothing better than home, but I get into to camp mode. Your sole focus is, is the fight. This is a once in a lifetime opportunity for me and I'm embracing it and I'm, and I'm taking it with both hands. I'm not really a villain. I'm more of an anti-hero. A villain is doing evil things. Anti-hero, he's doing things for what's the best, right? Yeah, I'm not a villain. They just don't understand me. Let's push that condition to another level, man. Three. Two, one, let's go right now. Attack it. Rolly Romero understands perception shapes reality. His flamboyant and boisterous persona has caught attention and opened doors, but has yet to fully yield the respect he desires. With Romero, words are prelude, 
hype, sell. But the ring, that's his arena of truth. Whether on a blockbuster stage or winning his first world title, he aims to show the world that the super lightweight champion is more than just his persona. A persona, by the way, that hides a deeper narrative. You know, as, as a kid, I spent a lot of time alone. I didn't really have no friends. I really couldn't speak until I was about 11 or so. You know, I, I, it sounded like I was speaking gibberish, you know? I think that's the reason why I enjoy every moment as much as I do now. Because I never had any of this growing up. The fact that I have the impact I do on the world, that's enough to make me happy, you know, to give me genuine joy. Good. Hips up a little bit? Good. I started boxing so late, I had to play catch up with everybody. All the top fighters around my age group, every single one of them has two, 300 fights, right? And you get me, 16 fights that I became world champion twice, so. I always fight the most difficult fights. I don't decline a fight. Pitbull Cruz is a tremendous fighter, but I'm gonna beat the shit out of him. He's gonna come forward and try to beat the fuck out of me. And I don't really care whether people think I'm gonna beat him or not. I just know I'm gonna knock him out. You'll see. March 30th. From Mexico City's urban sprawl, a remarkable lineage of legendary Mexican boxers have emerged. Intent on joining them, Isak Pitbull Cruz stands as a rising force, poised to carve his own legacy in the rich tapestry of this brave, fearless tradition. Podría describir el estilo mexicano como un estilo de mucha valentía, de muchos golpes, de que va hacia enfrente, pero siendo inteligente. Soy un peleador que se asimila más al estilo aguerrido, entonces por eso es un 100% de que tengo las características de, del estilo mexicano. Cruz most embodied this relentlessness in an epic 2021 showdown against Giovante Tank Davis. As a last-minute replacement, he still clashed for 12 grueling rounds, taking respect even in defeat. Yo creo que en su cabeza pensó, ¿de dónde me sacaron a este, no? Él estaba entrando en un punto de desesperación, pues no me podían hacer daño, no? Y le dimos una gran pelea. Bueno, para mí ese es el estilo mexicano. Es mi papá, Memo Cruz, que fue el que inició el, el legado de la dinastía Cruz. Mi papá me encaminó en el boxeo también, pues es por, por tener un sobresalir y, y viajar, ¿no? Que es lo que a mí me motivó el, el viajar en avión, en, en andar en una limusina. Todo eso pues me hizo una disciplina bastante, bastante buena. El gusto por el box le nació a Isaac, que uno no quería que fuera boxeador, que estudiaran, pero le gustaron los trancazos y pues aquí lo tenemos. Ahorita tenemos aquí con Isaac esa estrella que, que puede darle a toda la familia y más que nada él por, por él mismo su meta principal en la vida, que es el título del mundo. Tengo palabras para, para describir a Romero, que si habla no me importa, que si dice no me importa. Ese perro chihuahua se le va a aparecer, se le va a transformar, que él nunca va a poder olvidar y nunca se le va a volver a aparecer ese perro chihuahua que le está diciendo y que va a ser su pesadilla toda la vida. As the anticipation for March 30th intensifies, the journey ahead unfolds with more challenges. Stay tuned.
It's Saturday night, and I'm itching for a fight. Boxing superstar Keith One Tom Thurman steps up to take down a rising star. But undefeated champion Tim Zhu has other ideas. One time? Nah. It's my time. Plus, world champ Rolly Romero never misses words. Pitbull, all bark, no bite. But Mexican powerhouse Pitbull Cruz is ready to silence the trash talker. Saturday nights are made for fights. Live on PDC Pay-Per-View on Prime Video. Yes, I'm getting hyped up. Price up, loud and clear, turn my mic up. High up, gold medals up in my clutch. You better get ready, cause soon the time's up. Price up, loud and clear, turn my mic up.